What's up guys, it's Cooper and I want to give you a quick BTS of a commercial I shot for Somnium. This was a really cool shoot for a CrossFit apparel company and the mood of it is really really dark and gritty and it's a style that I really like and a style that I'm really drawn to uh, so I definitely felt like I was a perfect fit for this project. The talent for the shoot was an incredible CrossFit athlete named Aaron Washington. He did a really incredible job on the shoot and was super easy to work with. In this piece we see Aaron do several different CrossFit workouts. He does battle ropes, pull-ups, rope climb, and he also does some weightlifting. When we started conceptualizing for this piece, I knew right away that I wanted to shoot anamorphic. I really loved the results I got with the Red Scarlet W in tandem with Lomo anamorphic lenses. Um, they're vintage Russian lenses. Uh, they just look amazing. They take the digital edge off the Red Dragon sensor, and I felt the combination just fit this project really well. On my location scout, I knew right away that I wouldn't use any available lighting on this shoot. There was a lot of space and mounting points to light in this gym, uh, which is really a DP's dream, so it was pretty easy to light. The support tools that I used on the shoot were the 15-foot Jimmy Jib Crane and also the Easy Rig Vario 5. My crane operator Ty absolutely killed it on the shoot. All of the focal links that we used on the crane shots were 50 millimeter and above. That's pretty telephoto for crane shots and so there's not a lot of room for error and Ty take after take just executed and he absolutely killed it. The Easy Rig was a really important support tool on the shoot. Um, I used it for all of the handheld shots. The Lomo anamorphics are really heavy lenses that combined with the brain, combined with the other camera accessories, the camera was around 20 pounds. And so uh, just throwing the easy rig on just made it easier to handle the camera all day. Having that exact same camera lens package on my shoulder, that would have definitely taken its toll. And so the easy rig definitely a must have tool and uh, really did its thing on the shoot. The model of the Easy Rig I used on the shoot was the Vario 5 with the Gimbal Rig Vest. Super comfortable fit, definitely an amazing tool. I used two different monitors for the shoot, the Small HD 1703 P3 and also the Small HD 502. I used the 1703 to dial in all of my lighting and exposure. My crane operator Ty was also able to monitor using the 1703. The wireless system that I used was the Teradek 500 bolt, and so no cables on the shoot. Uh, super handy, super convenient. For all of the Easy Rig shots, I use the Small HD 502. Uh, it's a really lightweight, compact monitor, perfect for on camera work, keeps the weight down. Definitely a must have tool that worked really well on the shoot. The fact that I have access to a lot of the same tools that I use on the 1703 on the 502. Um, it's just a really great convenient thing. So when I do have to step away from the 17 inch, I'm um, still in good hands. I could still check false color. Uh, just definitely a lifesaver. The lights that I chose to use for the shoot were bicolor quasar tubes, one by LED panels, and also a 1200 HMI light. I chose these sources because they gave me high output with a small footprint. In a single shot, a quasar can be used as a practical, a backlight, a toner for the room because of the wide beam source, and uh, also flare your lens with the Lomo anamorphics. Uh, so just a lot of capability within one light. The quasar tubes were really easy to install throughout the scene and just gave the look a lot of punch. We also threw some haze in the background that played really nicely with the quasar tubes and just gave the gym a nice atmosphere. This was a really great shoot with an incredible crew, and I'm so happy with how the final product came out. The window of time that we had for the shoot was really small, and so there wasn't a second to waste, and everybody really pulled together, and we got the job done. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch. A link to the final piece is in the description below. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.